Hi, this is Sean, registered nurse with the Mass Support Network. Welcome to part two of our look at COVID safety reopening measures. Outdoor dining. Pro, it's outdoors, so transmission's gonna be lower, but con, you're gonna be stationary for a long period of time near a bunch of other people. There are a lot of questions to ask in any outdoor dining scenario. How close are the tables? Are there any barriers between them? Are people encouraged to mask up when not eating? It's a good rule of thumb, Think about how you'd feel if someone at another table was smoking. Cigarette smoke is a pretty good model for how viral aerosols travel. B minus, margin of error of a full letter grade. Hand washing stations. Now this one is tricky. We know now that the coronavirus doesn't spread on surfaces as well as we used to think. So washing your hands when coming into or out of a store only lowers the transmission by a little bit. But, Washing your hands is still a good idea in general. It will stop you from getting sick from all the other germs on the exercise equipment at the gym, for example. And if we keep it up, we might have an easier flu season this year, and we could use all the help we can get. B. Deep. deep cleans. Closing a store for an hour a day or a day a week to spray down the whole place with Lysol sounds really super serious, but it doesn't do all that much against a respiratory illness. In fact, it wastes a lot of time and resources. And on top of that, if a business closes for part of the day to clean, it increases the congestion in the rest of the day. C minus. Curbside takeout. It's hard to do better than this. Picking up takeout is less time inside than a trip to the grocery store. Many places will put your order on a table outside so you don't even have to come in at all. A. A plus if you can pay online and a big fat C minus for you if you aren't tipping. Whatever it is the Denver Broncos are doing here. What? What even is this? How? Why, why did they? It, are they just spraying themselves with sanitizer? How, how would that stop the respiratory transmission? I, F. F, 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 F. When you're evaluating a business's reopening plan, remember that it's a combination of safety measures that will make for the safest experience. Outdoor dining with masks, take out with distance markers for the lines. Look for measures that complement each other and don't think that walking through a thin mist of sanitizer will do anything. You can find more from the Mask Support Network on our website or on social media. Remember, wear your mask, wash your hands, and be here if you need us. Stay safe.